Number 10. Stars can come back from the dead. Who thought zombification wasn't limited to earthlings only, and the process started with corpses rising from their graves? It turns out that stars can also be zombified. Type LA supernova are often referred to as zombie stars for their ability to come back from death. When a star dies and becomes a white dwarf, and given the right situation, it creates a gargantuan supernova, which sucks so much material from neighboring stars that it will be brought back to life, like a giant space defibrillator. Number 9. Galactic Cannibalism Well, like it wasn't enough to be able to wake up from being dead, now space houses cannibalism too. Known as galactic cannibalism, this interesting cosmic phenomenon is when two galaxies collide and one galaxy absorbs the other. As we all know, galaxies have gravity. When these galaxies collide with one another, the gravitational pull of both galaxies tugs at each other. Feeling quite safe on Earth? Well, our galaxy is on its way to collide with the Andromeda galaxy. Well, 4 billion years gives us some time, though. Number 8. Planets Gone Rogue Planets are supposed to revolve around a star, as we all know what Earth is doing with the Sun. But not all the planets want to follow the rules of the universe. So some of them just decide to go rogue. There are a lot of planets that have escaped the gravity of their parent stars. Some of these rogue planets can be three times the size of our planet Earth, whereas some can be 12 times the size of Jupiter. Simply, they are huge! And if any one of them decides to have a beef with Earth, you can guess the end result. Number 7. Savor those moonlit nights. Earth has only one natural satellite that we call the Moon. You may be a great fan of the Moon, but it seems that there is a possible future where there won't be any Moon. Scientists have found that the Moon continues to spin away from the Earth at the rate of 3.78 centimeters per year at about the same speed at which our fingernails grow. Without the Moon, the Earth could slow down enough to become unstable, but this would take billions of years for our Moon to disappear. Number 6. Floating Corpses in Space History was written when Neil Armstrong took the first steps on the Moon, but not many are aware of the sacrifices that had to be made in order to get astronauts up into space at all. Many animals, and even some humans, lost their life in that process, and some of that happened in space. And as there is no oxygen in space, their bodies don't decompose. This means their corpses are now a part of the space junk that's just floating around. Number 5. The Hottest Supernova when a star dies, it explodes at the last moment of its lifetime, and this particular explosion is known as a supernova. Supernova explosions are actually the biggest explosion that occurs in the entire universe. A supernova can even outshine an entire galaxy. And before the explosion, a supernova can get really hot. Till now, the ASA SSN-15LH has been recorded as the brightest supernova ever. It reached a peak luminosity of about 570 billion solar luminosity, or 100 billion Kelvin. Just to make it understandable, the Earth's temperature is 288 Kelvin. Number 4. There are white holes, too. Yes, it seems white holes exist, too. Well, at least theoretically. And if you have guessed it right that they are the opposite of the black holes, in the case of black holes, something can only enter it. Nothing comes out of it, not even light. In the case of white holes, nothing can enter into a white hole from the outside. According to physicists, both of them share exactly the same mathematics, exactly the same geometry. There are theories that every galaxy has a supermassive black hole at its center, and every supermassive black hole spawns a white hole. Before we jump into our top three, here are some honorable mentions. Dark Flow One minute you know that you're simply sitting in a place on Earth, and in another minute you learn that actually, no, something from outside the universe, a force so unimaginable, is pulling every single galaxy towards it. It's a phenomenon called dark flow, a movement of hundreds of galaxy clusters at about 2 million miles per hour in the direction of the unknown. Quite assuring, right? The most powerful in the physical universe. Quasars! You might not be familiar with it, but it is one of the most powerful, energetic, and luminous objects in the universe. These celestial objects are found mostly at the center of various active galaxies. How powerful, you ask? 
One of them can emit more than a thousand times more energy compared to a galaxy like our Milky Way, which contains about 200 to 400 billion stars. Number 3. What's inside a black hole? Now here's the thing. Black holes are known as one of the most mysterious aspects of space science. And the reason it's that intriguing to scientists is that nobody actually knows what happens inside one of them precisely. So what if you fall into a black hole? Some theories suggest two possible scenarios. In one scenario, you will be burned down instantly. In another reality, you will be unharmed. But how can that be? Because time doesn't work the same near the black holes as it does on Earth. Just don't go jumping into one like Matthew McConaughey did in Interstellar. Number 2. End of our solar system Science has proved that the universe will end one day, but what about our solar system? How will it end? Well, it will start with what's in the center of it, the sun. When the sun will replenish its hydrogen, it will start expanding and become a red giant ball. That will be the end of humanity in our solar system. So better have an alternative universe to settle in, people from 5 billion years in the future. Number 1. The end of it all. The Big Bang is how things started if you listen to science. And because of that explosion, the universe is expanding. But when will it end? It seems the end will be in a similar way, just following the opposite process. There are theories that the universe will start to shrink and will recollapse to its earliest state with a big crunch or a big rip. These are mostly the reverse of the Big Bang. Let us know which one you think is the scariest in the comments section below. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel if you haven't, and turn on notifications so you're up to date on all the channel's updates. See you in the next video.